Hi friends, Erica Tesla here. Welcome to my channel. If you're new, thank you so much for deciding to click on this video. And if you're returning, it's so good to have you back. Today I wanted to chat with you guys a little bit about my experience at Creators and Friends and also do a bit of a haul with you guys and show you some of the things that we got while we were on this Creators trip. It was so fun guys. So I'm going to open with just sharing that it was beyond what I expected. I don't know what I was thinking was going to happen, but it was just the best. Everyone was incredible. All of the creators that I interacted with, which was pretty much everyone were incredibly kind. I had the opportunity to meet people that I have watched on YouTube for many years and meet them in person. And it, exceeded my expectations and so I'm just so grateful for the experience. Now if you don't know what Creators and Friends is, it's a business that Samantha March and Simbri of Simbri Thinks on Instagram started together. So they are business partners and they have put together these events for creators to come together and build community. So I love the premise behind it because it's about connection and not competition so the idea is that you come together and we learn from each other we interact with each other and in this case we built friendships and i'm so grateful for that because i got to connect with people that i've chatted with online and meeting them in person was just so wonderful everyone on the trip was incredibly kind authentic just themselves it was just really cool it was not your typical brand trip i don't know if i could say typical i've never been on a brand trip before but i have just heard about them and it wasn't structured in the way that i think we traditionally think about brand trips for one everyone did contribute to participate in the trip so we did pay a small fee to be able to participate in the trip to hold our spot and I think that that was really nice because it allowed Simbri and Samantha to plan for all of the creators who were going to come. So it was definitely worth it in my opinion. Now when we got to the house and if you didn't know the trip took place in New Orleans and I've never been to New Orleans before. Um, it was it was such a, an incredible experience. I was just so excited to be in a new city, meet new people, and push myself to have a new experience. And for me, as a content creator with a much smaller following, I did not feel like I was differentiated in any way by anyone. Everybody was just incredibly welcoming. Samantha and Simbri did a fantastic job. And to that point, they did a really great job connecting with brands on this trip who sponsored the trip. Sigma was, I think, one of the larger sponsors of this trip, and they provided us with some really beautiful goodies. We also had City Beauty. We had a number of brands participate in this trip and participate in giving us just an incredible experience. So I'm going to go through the products from the brands with you guys just because I thought it would be really fun to show you what we got and maybe introduce you to some brands that are new to you. I know some of the brands I've never had the opportunity to use before so it was a really cool way to learn about different brands that um, have really nice products that I just did not know about. So I really appreciate the whole experience in its entirety, the location, the house was really beautiful. We had fantastic food and we just had really good times. We made some really incredible memories. So I'm really, really grateful to all of the content creators who made this trip such an unforgettable experience that I will remember for the rest of my life. And I'm so grateful to Samantha and Simbri for organizing this trip for us. So with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the goodies that we got. I have a bunch of stuff behind me and I'm going to be reaching back here and just briefly talk about each thing. And if there's anything that you are particularly excited about or want more information about, please don't hesitate to leave me a comment down below. And before I keep going, please, please, please consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you join my little corner of the internet. And please definitely don't forget to like this video if you enjoy makeup content, and in this case, makeup hauls. I'm gonna try to go in somewhat chronological order of the experience. So the first day that we got to the house, 
we were a little bit early so a group of us met at baggage claim at the airport and then we were a little bit of ahead of time of the house opening so we went and grabbed some lunch got to hang out chat get to know each other a little bit and then we made our way to the house which was a block away from the restaurant where we were eating and that's where we got our room assignments and when we got to our rooms we also got to see where our bathrooms were and we walked into the bathrooms guys these beautiful makeup bags or toiletry bags were waiting for us with our names on them and so this bag is from a brand called city beauty they contacted me a little bit before the trip but i wasn't super familiar with them prior to this experience but guys this bag is so pretty it has this chenille feel and my name here in gold and they spelled it right which is always a win so i'm just going to show you some of the stuff that they have in here so we have a invisicrape body balm so honestly i overpacked for this trip guys because they had everything that we needed to have a successful trip so we had this bump this smells really really nice it's a very nice emollient creamy body product then we have the blue defense hydro gel which is supposed to be applied morning and night um this is for really like dry skin so this is something that i'm really excited to have and then we also have the restoring hand treatment really really nice so this is to help smooth your hands i think sometimes hand care gets ignored when we're talking about skincare products but i have really really dry skin especially in the winter time here we're emerging into the spring and summer months where i live but um this is definitely gonna still come in handy because um i don't know about you but even before COVID, I was an avid hand washer. So hand cream is always, always welcome. Then we have this beautiful lip oil, the City Lips Night Oil. I'm a dry lip girly, so I'm very excited about that. And then we have these gorgeous plumping lip glosses. So, oh, sorry, I've got to mix up a product in there. So we have these lip glosses, really beautiful shades very wearable shades and i'm very excited to have these when we were at the house they had some on the bathroom uh, vanity area for us to try i was so busy i didn't even get to try them so some of these products guys i'm opening with you for the very first time and then finally they did give us some very lovely skincare tools so we have a face massager and a face roller as well and overall this was just such a gorgeous treat to walk into and so i'm going to go ahead and put these items back okay so as i might have mentioned in the intro sigma beauty played a major major role in sponsoring this trip guys when we walked into our bedrooms there was a full gorgeous spread of Sigma products. And I'm gonna show you what we got because not only did we get makeup items, makeup tools, we got clothes, guys. We got clothes. So as you can see, I have this adorable hat here that we got from Sigma, which is perfect. And it's very, very comfortable, guys. Like this is one that I have not stopped wearing. I got back from New Orleans and I don't know who out there is a sport parent but when you're out there on a soccer field baseball field whatever it is like hats like these come in handy and especially if you're trying to watch out for the sun this is really really nice and then we got guys the cutest pajamas with the sigma logo on them so as i'm showing you these things i'm going to be folding them up because um we're getting ready to go on another trip really soon and these are coming with me um i think these were from the brand stars above from target and they make some amazing pajamas so i love that they embroidered the sigma logo on there these were super duper comfortable and it came with the little shorts super duper cute because i, I remember we were asked what size we were in shirts i don't think i got asked what size i was in a pajama so it was customized to the sizing that we gave them and so it was so nice to have some new pajamas because i will tell you i'm the worst at buying new pajamas for myself i usually buy the holiday sets 
at Target, um, but I will wear those down, guys. It's actually quite tragic. So I was very excited to get some new pajamas. And then we have, guys, look at this sweatshirt. Now, I know some of the ladies have been posting their, their um, blogs and vlogs and things like that. So you might have seen these shirts floating around. And guys, these are super duper comfortable. This is, I think, Champion brand, which by the way, I'm so surprised Champion has made a resurgence because when I was growing up, um, I don't know, it wasn't as cool as it is now. Now it's like really, really cool. So it's kind of fun and funny to me to see like things that I grew up with, like making a resurgence in terms of their level of coolness. Guys, I'm telling you, Sigma, they had like a full bag of goodies. I'm going to show you. I actually brought the bag home just so you guys can get an idea like of how big it is. And there was like another bag of stuff. And then there was this bag, this canvas bag with stuff. I mean, they really did it up, guys. Like they did such an amazing job just spoiling us. And by the way, I do have a code with Sigma, Erica, in case you were interested in purchasing purchasing anything at a discount. And I think until the 10th, you can get 25% off the website. So I'm gonna try to get this video up for you guys so that you can take advantage of that discount. But they did give us their brush shampoo, which works really, really well. I've used the samples before. And then we have the Sigma Switch Instant Shade Remover. This is something that is going to travel with me, guys, because when you're on the go, I do take quite a few makeup brushes, but when you're dealing with eyeshadow, it's nice to have that as a product. And then we have another makeup brush cleanser and tool. This deep cleans brushes. So this is like a little compact one that you can put on the side of your sink and wash your brushes. Uh, so I'm really excited to have these tools. And speaking of brushes, I have the Sigma brush mat here, the Sigma brush cleaning mat. So this is like an express cleaning mat that you um, put in the sink. This is really nice to have. Um, I have another one of their brush cleaners that's like a mitt. They sent this to me before and I love this thing because it's just good for on the go. So one of the nights we had a dinner where the founder of Sigma, Dr. Simone Xavier, talked about her experience founding the business. It was incredibly inspiring. She has her doctorate, which for me really resonated. For those of you who don't know, I finished my doctorate last spring. It was just one of those canon moments in my life. It was something I worked so hard for. So for me, it was incredibly inspiring to hear from someone who's been through that process and their pivot into entrepreneurship. And so it was just such an incredible experience. And so there have been some incredible products that they're getting ready to put out. So these brushes, guys, that are coming out, let me show you this beautiful box. Yes, I put all this stuff in my suitcase. Look at these. These are coming out April 11th. So I'm again, I'm going to try to get this video up and out for you guys before then so that you can either get on the wait list or make sure that you're ready to purchase these. But they have these gorgeous new face brushes. So we have a coverage brush. We have an angled concealer, angled cheek, a sculpting brush. And I've already used this one. Um, I washed it and I put it in the box like trying, trying to pretend like I haven't used this yet so you guys can see how it looks, like just how gorgeous these brushes are. And Sigma brushes have been a favorite of mine for a long time, even before this experience. Like I remember Sigma was probably one of my bigger purchases and investments in terms of like a quality brush. And my Sigma brushes have lasted for years, you guys. So I'm really excited. I'm gonna show you a couple of other things before I get to like the really like big kahuna Sigma beauty item. So we got a color correcting duo and I'm not sure how they personalized it, but they, they knew, they knew. So I have the one in dark to deep and I like this peachy shade for myself, for my blemishes. And then this one I can use like for some of my like more pronounced hyperpigmentation. And it's so cute. It's very, it's a very nice formula, very, very good at covering and blending into your makeup. And then we have the, these hair clips. 
I don't have a ton of hair, but if I do need to clip my hair back for some reason, or if you're doing makeup, I'm thinking these will come in handy because when I'm doing makeup on clients, like sometimes their hair gets in the way. You don't want to mess it up and get makeup and hair mixed all together. So then I got this beautiful bronzer as well. I'm going to open this up for you guys. And I've been having a blast with the Sigma products that I have been trying. So we have this deep bronzer really really beautiful this is a shade that will definitely work for me i'm not sure if they have one that goes deeper so that's something that i need to research but this is they, they have some beautiful complexion product formulations and it makes sense for the brushes that they're putting out there that they have been expanding their product range and then i'm going to show you guys this beautiful cream blush i actually have this one this is in the shade nearly wild and this blush is incredible i love how it gives like this sun burned without the pain kind of look like just like a really beautiful natural flush it's such a gorgeous cream blush and then i did not have this blush before but this is the core de rosa blush guys and Let's take a look at this. This is really pretty. This is like a very like soft everyday shade and it's in theme with their Cor de Rosa palette. I don't have that one. I might have to pick that one up because I've really been enjoying the Sigma eyeshadow formula. I don't know what took me so long guys to get it together. Actually on my eyes right now I have on the new mod palette which I've had for a while. I really really enjoy that palette. Finally well, not really finally, but next I have the Sigma Soft Focus Setting Powder in the shade Cinnamon. So for me, as you can see, this is like a good all over setting powder and I probably would use this more in the summertime. I'm on the cusp of having consistently warm weather where I live. So I will be outside a little bit more and hopefully I'll get a little bit of a tan. That would be really, really nice. So those, oh, and let me not forget you guys, I'm over here forgetting stuff. We have the Renew Lip Oil, and this one is in the shade All Heart. And I'll just show you guys what it looks like. It's just a really pretty lip oil. And again, I can never get enough hydrating lip products. I love hydrating lip products, so I'm really excited to have this. This is probably one that's just gonna get popped in my purse and be used every day. So that is pretty much it for the Sigma stuff. But, 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 there is one more thing that you guys need to see that we, listen, we were not, we were not expecting this. We walked into dinner and there were these boxes. Okay. These boxes. And we're like, what could that be? So here's the cool neutrals palette. Yes, I brought this whole box home. Like I wanted you guys to see, I wanted you guys to see like the whole experience. I was not about to leave this box in recycling. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this gorgeous box inspired by natural stones, like so beautiful. And here's the palette and I haven't touched it yet. Here we have the palette. This is the Sigma Cool Neutrals palette. This is going to be coming out May 2nd, my friends. And look at this piece here, the plastic cover. Even this is really beautiful, like the details on here. It comes with a beautiful mirror and the dual ended brush. Like, let me show you guys the brush. It's so pretty. I'm going to do influencer hands for you guys real quick. So we have a dual ended brush and I really like the Sigma dual ended brushes. I think they do such a good job. Like the fibers are very soft. Sometimes you get a dual ended brush and it's very scratchy and rough or it's a sponge tip applicator. Sigma doesn't skimp out on that. So it's really nice. You have just everything that you need to do your looks and just look at these colors. These colors are stunning. And we have an even mix of shimmers and mattes in this palette. And I didn't dig into this yet because I just really wanted to show you guys pristinely just how it looks. So I'm really excited to do some looks with this. I'm going to be taking this with me on my travels so that I can do some looks with this. 
this is just like to me the perfect like everyday palette like you can do very simple looks or you can vamp it up it's just stunning so i'm really really excited and so this is a really exciting release for sigma i'm so excited to see this palette do really really well and i think it's really well thought out it's very on trend because cool neutrals are in right now okay so that was so exciting now we had also a brunch with Surat. so i'm going to show you guys the products from Surat. we received this beautiful quad this is the beyond beige quad well first of all let's take a minute to admire the packaging it's super stunning and look at these shades so these are just like really beautiful everyday shades like these are colors that i would wear in real life every day this just looks really stunning and i've never tried surat before so i'm really excited to try out the brand and then the next product that we got our graphic eyeliner in chat noir which means black cat in french so here's the box here's the eyeliner and i think let's see okay do we have to what do we have to do is it a... so we have this graphic eyeliner um i'm gonna have to learn how to use that because there's no pigment on it yet so maybe i have to shake it i haven't figured that one out so there might be a learning curve for me with that particular product and then we have the noir lash tent and this component is really beautiful. The packaging is really stunning. And oh, okay, so this looks like a little bit of a mascara. So I guess this is something, oh, this is kind of interesting. So I guess if you just wanted to darken your lashes, this is a very interesting take on mascara. The packaging is just so elegant and very, very chic. And then we have a clear brow pomade. And guys, like I said, I'm opening some of this stuff for the first time. Um, so we have this little brush here to brush your lashes up and to keep them in place. And then finally, we have a blush. Now I did try this blush while I was there. I think the shade is gonna be a little bit okay well you know what there we go it's very pink it's a very cool pink initially the product wasn't coming out for me so i think i was a little bit concerned like i would not be able to get this to show up on my skin but it looks like it's going to be like a very cute cool pink and so yeah so thank you so much to Surat for participating in this event these are some really beautiful products i'm really excited to try the brand out so before I get into more makeup, I'm going to have a little bit of an interlude. I'm going to tell you guys, we did something so fun. We had an event one night called Secret Sister. Actually, it was the first night that we got there. And my secret sister was Heather Austin. And I started to freak out a little bit because I was like, what can I get her? She has such impeccable taste in makeup. She has the newest product so it took me a little bit of brainstorming and then I was like duh you know what to get her so I reached out to my friends at Cushy and I was like oh I'm gonna buy uh, a makeup bag for Heather for the creators and friends trip and so I'm just gonna show you guys as an example this is my Cushy bag and they sent me a Cushy bag well I was gonna just buy her a bag and just call it a day well, they went overboard. They sent me a bag. This is the vacationer size. I think she got the um, like the medium size one. And they sent me a bunch of their like bottle protectors, the pencil cases, all of that stuff. And I'm pretty sure she was pretty happy with it. It was something different and from what she already had. And with somebody who has an extensive makeup collection, which I definitely appreciate, it's nice to have all of the things that you need to organize yourself if you're traveling with a sizable amount of makeup. So Cushy has the cutest pouches, bags, and they're incredible quality. And the interior of the bags, 
can be taken out and washed, which I really, really love because I am an avid makeup user. So you can see here, I have mine pretty full. I've washed this several times and I've had such great success. And this section, now mine has a brush holder, but then um, there's also this lining that comes out, guys. You can unzip this lining and take it out and you can either interchange it or take it out to wash it. So this is mine and this part comes undone and you can just mix and match and they come out with different colors um, in different seasons. And so, yeah, I really love that bag. So I'm really happy that, that Heather is happy with her secret sister gift. Now I got Karen, Karen Harris as my secret sister and so she gave me guys what every influencer needs um so one for one i got this mobile led light like i don't know if you've seen those um i think on tiktok they're always like advertising them but these are so cool so there are these lights that you clip onto your phone so if you are out somewhere maybe the lighting's not the best you can attach it to your phone and you will have light and i love those for like taking selfies and pictures at night and dark spaces that kind of thing and then she got me this amazing selfie stick that extends guys it's incredible like i can put my phone here and this this thing it pulls out and it actually turns into i'm going to show you a tripod so I'm going to see if Karen has this like in linked in an Amazon shop or something like that. So you guys can um, check this out. But if you like selfie sticks, like I can't tell you how happy I was. I was genuinely happy. Like I was not faking my genuine joy at having a selfie stick. I used to have a selfie stick and I don't know what happened to it. But at some point um, it got lost somewhere. I think we moved. I think it was when we moved to this house. I lost my selfie stick and it was one of those things where I would have liked to have had it, but I just never got around to replacing it. So thank you to Karen so much for my light, my selfie stick. They are the perfect influencer gifts and I'm so grateful for them. I know you put a lot of thought into it. I really appreciate it. So that was my little interlude. Let's go ahead and get back into the makeup stuff. Nona Cosmetics, if you're not familiar with them, they are just an incredible indie brand so i brought this box back and guys they did the most incredible workshop with us so they set up these little areas for us to make our own nail polish so not only did they provide one of their nail polishes from the dragon fruit collection which i'm about to show you but they taught us how to mix nail polish and I actually have my nail polish on now. I called this color Sai Sai after my son, Sydney and Silas. But while we were making the nail polish, look at this cute apron. And the fruit alludes to an upcoming collection. I don't know all of the details, but in the box, in addition to the apron, we got two new fruit lighters. So I don't know if you guys are familiar with the dragon fruit collection with Emily Violet Marie, but she did these amazing highlighters with Cleona that I absolutely love. I think there's like one more release of them before they discontinue that collection. If you haven't tried them, get them, but there are some new ones coming out. So I have this one here. This is the fruit lighter in the shade Tangy. And I can't help but swatch it because it's Cleona. I mean, look at that. So that's Tangy. Technically, this is a highlighter, but I use them on the eyes as well. And then we have the shade Quench. And I'm going to try and swatch that on there. Look at that. And guys, they had these personalized in everyone's boxes. So these are going to be absolutely stunning on. Okay, and then, and then, and then, and then, let me get my makeup, right. let me clean my hands, okay. So then we got this cute makeup bag, 
and I actually have this one I really love this bag it's so cute it's so pretty it's perfect for like your like pencils and lip liners and things like that it's such a nice little bag it's very nice quality and this is from the dragon fruit collection as well and then we got this really beautiful scarf I haven't taken mine out of the plastic yet but I'm thinking that I'm going to actually use this at night I really like satin scarves to cover my hair at night and I just feel like this would be really fashionable and beautiful and who wouldn't want to go to sleep feeling like a princess at night and then guys oh they gave us nine gorgeous eyeshadows so here are the shadows and I wore a couple of these during the trip and I would come downstairs and everyone's like what is on your eyes and it's like because everybody was in different places in terms of opening up the various items in their goodie bags and I was like guys get into these shadows they're absolutely stunning and I, I had brought some of my own already but these were just like really really beautiful so and this is in their newer format like they have pressed them a little bit differently and these traveled home pretty well I'm pretty pretty happy I was a little bit worried because I did take them out of the bubble wrap like I just was a makeup goblin and I couldn't wait to try them so I took them out of the bubble wrap because I wanted to wear them in New Orleans okay and then last but not least we have the nail polishes so I'm going to show you the one that is already existing let's see which where do we have that yeah so this is the shade okay this is dragon teeny so this is a shade that's already existing this is in the dragon fruit collection i have this shade i've worn it i love these this color so i'm glad to have a refreshed bottle of it because it is one of the shades I wear quite often and then there is a new shade that's coming out guys called juicy and the ladies of Cleona along with Samantha Simbri and I think Linda helped as well in terms of setting up our our little kits to do the nail polish activity guys look at this shade so this is the shade juicy it's just this beautiful golden shade and then we had a chance to do our own custom color. So I'll show you guys the shade that I have on right now that I called Sci Sci. It looks like this in the bottle. And I'm quite proud of it because it just, depending on what I'm wearing, it kind of seems to adjust the color. Like this looks really pretty with like green colors. Then I did another shade called NOLA 2024. I think a lot of us did a NOLA 2024 shade. No one's looks the same, but we did a color that kind of inspired us and reminded us of being in New Orleans. So this kind of has like that fun Mardi Gras vibe to me. And it's, it's like a purpley shade. It's really, really pretty on. And then last but not least, I made a shade called Just Chill. <laughs> That's my mantra. Just be chill. So yeah, this is such a pretty shade too. I think this one kind of reminds me of just hanging out on the beach and just like chilling out and just being relaxed and just chill. So it was so fun to be like a kid and to like do a craft. Like I felt like it was like summer camp. I think Ali but Ali Dawson, she said it best. It was like being in summer camp and I never went to like a sleepaway camp, but I imagine like that's what it was like because we just had fun and we were talking, we we're hanging out and mixing nail polish and you know, Lee and Maggie were like the super nice teachers because I spilled something. No one got mad at me and I really appreciated that. So we had such a good time and it was just such a well executed activity. So I was really, really grateful for that experience. So the next thing I want to talk about, I want to talk about some other makeup items guys and then we're gonna kind of get into some skincare so unearthly cosmetics was another participant in this event and they gifted us some really gorgeous items guys like i wanted to show you guys the packaging 
Like they have my name on here. So this was in the bag when I got to the room and I felt really special that it had my, my name on there. And I know that some influencers that are maybe more accustomed to being at events like this, maybe it's not as big of a deal, but I don't know that I ever thought I would get invited to something like this. So it just felt really special. And I think a lot of us felt really special being able to participate in something like this because brand trips, they feel kind of inaccessible at times. Like it just feels like you have to be like chosen or something like that. And I mean, this was an experience where there were people from just a variety of backgrounds coming together and it was just really, really nice. So here are these gorgeous palettes from Fantasy Cosmetica. And this is the Rogue palette. And I cannot wait to dig into this. Like this color story is my jam. You have these gorgeous cool tones and jewel tones and a couple of pastels thrown in here. Like, and these shimmers, these multi-chromes are really, really beautiful. I love this color story. And then we have the other palette. Let me put this back in the sleeve. So then we have the Druid palette, which has this really, another gorgeous color story. I love greens. This matte color called Sage right here, this matte green looks delectable. Really, really beautiful color stories. Again, such a treat, so appreciative. These look like they will be absolutely beautiful. And then we got some goodies from Unearthly Cosmetics. Um, I'm a lash girly, so I'm very excited to have some additional lashes in my arsenal. Then we got a Satin Liquid Lipstick. And how cool is this? Like, like look at that. That's really, really neat. Now let's see if I can open this for you guys. Do I know what I'm doing? Yes, okay. So we have this kind of brown shade, this kind of mustardy brown shade. That's really cool. And this one is called Jeanette. I think this would look really neat with like a deep lip liner and then we have this one called ripe and this is the lip gloss again the packaging is like really cool and then i'm gonna try to like open this up for you guys so you can see oh it smells nice that's that's really pretty that's a really pretty shade so really, really cool. So thank you, Fantasy Cosmetica and Unearthly Cosmetics. Those look like such fun products. I'm really excited. I could see this shade Jeanette looking like really pretty with the, the Druid palette. Like that would be like a really neat combo. Okay, so there's still more guys. There is still more to come. So we got a few things from the brand, self-made. So we have the Secure Attachment Comfort Serum and the Corrective Experience Comfort Cream for face and body. So I'm set on body care. So Hydrate, De-Stress, Prime, Protect. So this is a serum. It looks really pretty. I can't smell anything and I'm, I'm afraid to like unscrew this right now. But the bottle is really, really stunning. And guys, um, I'm running out of space in front of me, so please excuse me if you hear things like getting shuffled around. <laughs> I'm trying to like simultaneously open things and keep the momentum of the video going. So we have self-made and then we have, let's see, this is the comfort cream. Let's see if this has a scent to it or not. This is very refreshing smelling. Like it doesn't have a strong scent, but it just feels like refreshing. It feels refreshing. Like this would be like a really great product in the summertime. And yes, 
hydrate, de-stress, soothe, and protect. Soothing is where I could, it has that soothing scent to it. Then we have Dr. Sam's Flawless Moisturizer. Like a hug for your skin, absorbs rapidly and delivers lasting hydration. Use as little or as much as you need. Okay, and they have a video I haven't had a chance to watch yet that shows you how to use this product. Guys, okay, so Salt New York, I wasn't super familiar with the brand before this trip, but the founder was on the trip, Kiki. We were contacted before the trip what shades do we want to try from the brand so we received this couple of compacts so we have like this really very cute little compact here with the highlighter in it it's a cream highlighter and you guys there's like a little mirror on this side and then we have this zipper compact absolutely stunning and it's refillable, so it's great because if you run out of one of your shades, you don't have to go and buy like a whole new thing. You just pop it in, so it's sustainable. This is like a very durable case. It's beautiful, and this comes with a mirror as well. And Kiki is absolutely incredible. They were explaining their brand and discussing how they were in the makeup industry for over 10 years, and they are the chemists like they're pouring the ingredients and fine-tuning and customizing the ingredients so it was really incredible to interact with kiki and to learn how they made that pivot from makeup artist to entrepreneur and i think that's the running theme we're seeing um you know people taking these opportunities in the creator space and turning it and growing it into something even more so i think that that was incredible and i found their story incredibly inspiring and plus everything is just like very high quality very chic sophisticated and easy easy to use and if you really like natural makeup this is really nice i really enjoyed how my makeup came up out the day that i used these products okay i'm almost to the end guys i know there's there's like a huge pile of stuff in front of me and some of y'all are about to be sick of me but i really wanted to do what i could to share this experience with you i'm going to go ahead and link the blogs that have been posted from this event so far so that you can see and get an idea of what i'm talking about but we had a really wonderful time and i just i'm really full of gratitude right now i feel really really grateful to all of the brands who participated but um that being said let's talk a little bit about undefined beauty um as you can see i already like opened this box i used this product this is a serum this is a i'm sorry a glow oil and this has spf 30 and i used this it's really really nice i mean and on top of the bottle just being like really stunning in the packaging being lovely i really liked this product and how it felt on my skin so this is an antioxidant rich waterless formula that protect, protects from everyday environmental aggressors and melts into skin. It includes vitamin C, amla, tomato seed, rose hip, restorative milk thistle, subaki seed, and moringa. So yes, lox and moisture would agree with that. Had a really good experience. And then this is something I really need. This is a scalp serum, guys. Like I, I need some help in the hair department because again you know hormones all of those fun things have changed my hair is not what it used to be so i'm really excited to try this this is a scalp serum and this is supposed to help with healthy shiny thick hair uh this water-based serum hydrates stimulates strengthens and nourishes your scalp via plant peptides niacinamide saw palmetto ashwagandha amla faux tea and caffeine so you apply to your scalp daily and massage in circular motion. So I think this is going to be really nice. And I haven't opened this one yet, but it does come with the, the dropper. And there's a sample of their, oops, of, there's a sample of the hydro jelly in here. So I'm very excited for this product. I've been trying out like different um, serums and conditioners and things for my hair. So I'm really excited to try that. Okay. I'm just gathering the last few bits of things guys. So we have the revive 
instant depuffing gel eye mask. I forgot to include this. I, this was in the box we got along with the Surratt Beauty products and I'm really excited to use this. I do sometimes have um, puffiness in the morning with my eyes and around the eye area so I'm excited to try this and we have six of these in here. We have another undefined beauty uh, sample here, a cleanser. Then we have this weighted eye mask, which I'm really interested to try. Um, it's supposed to help with your sleep and it says for a deeper, more restful sleep. That's something that since I've turned 40, 41, this might be really helpful for me. And then we have this really cute like little beer cozy or wine cozy or non-alcoholic beverage of your choice cozy. And then finally from Surratt, and I this one was a little bit of a stray. This is so pretty, guys. This is a, it's called the Inner Light Baton. And so it's like a really pretty liner. Okay, so you have the liner. It's almost my skin tone, so that's kind of hard to see. And then... If you open this side, there's like some shiny product in here. And look at that. Very, very pretty, very subtle. So this is called the Shimmer Baton and this is gonna be absolutely beautiful on the eyes. Very chic, very sophisticated. Okay, last but not least, last but not least, I we got some goodies from Amanda of makeup just for fun from her Etsy shop just for fun style. She gave us earrings Like look at those these beautiful earrings And I love the turquoise because that's my birthstone December and then these adorable Stickers and we've got her info here. So I'm gonna link her shop in the description box but she has Creators and Friends sticker, New Orleans with the New Orleans colors, and then a sticker that says, I am beautiful. And Amanda is just like so incredible. We had so much fun. And that's why I saved this part for last. So we had an auction night. We had an auction night and we got fake money where we got to put in bids on different products. And some of those products included gift cards, um, there was a beautiful carry-on suitcase like there was a variety of products and then there were mystery boxes And so Amanda and I you know We came up with a plan because you're allowed to pool your money together and We decided to pool our money together on a mystery box and the mystery box could either have something really good in it Or it could have like literal trash in it like I think Angelica she got a she went a piece of cardboard <laughs> And she was such a good sport about it. It was actually really hilarious and she modeled it she was just absolutely fantastic about it and so we had no idea what the heck we were gonna get in these boxes so we put in a bid and we got into a little bit of a bidding war with uh shelly from shelly saves the day and we ended up winning these guys these now um we got a pair of these sunglasses from the brand i will tell you who it is Sojo's. Sojo's sunglasses. Okay. So we won these sun, sorry, we got these sunglasses in our, um, in our goodie bags. So I actually didn't even open the ones that I received in the goodie bag, but these are the black frame sunglasses. I'll link their information below. I think you can get them in Amazon and you guys, they come in these like really cute bags. And you've got this little bottle cap on here. So it looks like a little soda. Like this is just super duper cute, like a little clutch bag. And then Amanda and I, oops, Amanda and I, we won sunglasses as well. So this is the pair that I won. And there was another pair just like this. And I gave the other pair, you could either share or keep it to yourself. And I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. Like Amanda and I, we pulled our money together. So of course we shared and it worked out. And um, we just acted so silly the whole night. And actually it was one of the best nights ever. We were just like cracking ourselves up. And at that point we were like, we won the auction. There's nothing left to bid. Um, there's nothing left for us to like try to get because we have reached the pinnacle. And we were just like hanging out and just like cracking ourselves up 
in our sunglasses. So yes, there are pictures of us being silly in sunglasses together. And um, it's a memory I will always treasure with Amanda. So she has the same pair. So we are twinning with the sunglasses. So you guys, I think that is it. Like I wish you could see, oh, I wish you could see in front of me y'all. Like it is kind of crazy looking, but I just wanted to go through everything with you guys and just kind of also talk while I'm talking through products like relive the experience because it was just really really special and I do need to add I do need to add that um the last night at the dinner Unearthly Cosmetics showed us their new spring collection that is coming out I think I'm going to be receiving that or at least I signed up to try to get that but um they have this gorgeous spring collection coming out and I'm going to see if there's a link to share. I will try to share that below or at least put information about that release. Um, but yeah, all of the brands were incredibly generous with us. Simbri and Samantha, again, I just cannot emphasize like what a beautiful job they did pulling this together, getting so many content creators together. And when I tell you like there were no egos, there were no egos. Like sometimes you see a favorite YouTuber and you're kind of thinking, is this person going to be a diva in real life? And I think that honestly, I had that fear or just an expectation like, okay, there might be a couple of them that are going to be divas and you know, that's fine. And I was pleasantly surprised and gladly wrong about that. And I I'm just so grateful to every single one of the attendees of this trip for just being so incredibly wonderful and kind. And I learned so much about myself and others. And I think that Simbri and Samantha are onto something really incredible. And, you know, they just put so much effort into it. Like you can't even imagine the amount of work that they did. I think Samantha put her blog or sorry, her blog up recently. And I'm just thinking, Oh my gosh, no wonder everything went so smoothly because they just did everything to perfection. It was just absolutely incredible from the people who came to the brands that worked with them to make this event possible. Everything came together really beautifully. And so yes, that is why if you follow any of the content creators, Okay guys, I interrupt our regularly scheduled programming to bring you a conclusion to my video. I apparently used up all of my memory card <laughs> and then I thought I filmed the ending of my video and I can't find it. I cannot find it. So I don't know what happened, but anyway, I just wanted to say thank you guys for watching this really long video and thank you so much for hanging in there, sticking with me. Um, I did want to add one more thing. I, for the life of me, I'm looking around through all the stuff for my bright lashes from Angela Bright. They are so beautiful and I don't know what is going on with them. And you guys have to excuse me because I'm packing. We're getting ready to head out to Australia on Friday. So I came home from one trip and it's a little bit chaotic right now. I have a lot of stuff. So I'm going to find those lashes because Angela Bright does have a lash brand. And I feel awful that I didn't get to tell you guys more about it throughout the video. I was looking for them. Can't seem to find them. They're misplaced, but they will be rediscovered. But in the meantime, I am going to link Angela's brand in the description box along with the other brands that provided beautiful products for us throughout the trip. And if you have questions about anything, please don't hesitate to leave me a comment. I'm going to close out this video by saying thank you so much again for taking time out of your day to hang out with me. Sorry for the choppy ending and I know I look a little bit disheveled. Hair's getting done tomorrow. We just have a lot going on this week, but I'm so grateful for each and every one of you that decides to tune into my channel and hang out and chat about makeup with me. I really appreciate you all. So thank you guys so much. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.